Imagine visiting the Internet Archive, one of the most trusted digital libraries, only to see a message popping up. 31 million of you have been compromised. Yes, this is exactly what happened on October 9th, when a cyber attack exposed millions of email addresses, usernames and encrypted passwords. Now, according to security researcher Troy Hunt, who confirmed the breach, hackers managed to steal sensitive data, adding to a growing list of internet hacks. Now, this attack wasn't just a one-off. Hacktivist group SN Black Matter claimed responsibility for launching several devastating distributed denial-of-service DDoS attacks that made the archive's iconic Wayback Machine inaccessible. The founder of Internet Archive acknowledged the breach, but with 31 million records at stake, concerns about data safety persist. But the attack also raises questions over delayed disclosure. Now, data stolen in September was only revealed in October, and the timing couldn't have been worse. The archive is already battling a massive copyright lawsuit that could cost $600 million. Now, could SN Black Meta's motives be politically charged? The group claimed they targeted the archive due to its supposed ties to the US criticizing the country's support for Israel. Ironically, the archive also houses key resources on Palestine. Now, even though passwords were encrypted using Bycrypt, Cybersecurity experts urge users to change their credentials, especially since many emails had already been part of previous breaches. Follow more story for more updates.